Listen, I absolutely love learning new things. I learned being able to dabble in things that I'm curious about and just pick up new skills. That is why I'm so happy that Skillshare is a sponsor of our show. A lot of people are taking a step back and reflecting on their career. People are realizing that some of the things that they thought they wanted to do in life, they might not. Or some people are like, I want to add more skills to what I can do already so I can grow my career even faster. Explore all your options and set yourself up for success with Skillshare. With countless on-demand classes taught by experts in design, marketing, software development, and more, you'll build the skills you need to chart a new course with confidence. Y'all already know I love Skillshare. I've used it for several classes. Um, I've used it for helping me create better TikToks um, uh, because they do a lot of storytelling, really good storytelling um, classes. I've also used it for my own personal growth as far as in doing a vision board, as well as trying to help me not kill all of my houseplants. I took a class on how to grow houseplants. Um, I absolutely love that. I love, love, love the classes. And I know you will too. Each Skillshare class is broken up into bite-sized modules packed with actionable insights. With Skillshare's project-based community-driven format, you'll start applying lessons right away and get feedback as you go along. One affordable yearly membership fee unlocks unlimited access to as many classes as you want, and you can keep learning on the go with the Skillshare app. Set sail for your career of, uh, for the, excuse me, set sail for the career of your dreams with Skillshare. Visit Skillshare.com slash SK. SK. Today to get your first month free. Visit Skillshare.com slash SK. SK. Today to get your free, uh, your first month free. That's Skillshare.com slash SK. SK. That means that. Five, four, three, two. What up, y'all? Welcome to Here's the Thing. I'm Kevin Stead. She's Angel. Another podcast episode. Smash that like button. Smash that notification button. Bangers, bangers, bangers. All 2022. Bangers, that's for you. We are back. We are still on the bereaved list. Hey, mm-hmm. Amen. Keep mm-hmm. the Fredericks, Fredericks family in prayer. Mm-hmm. Their brother done went on to meet him. Oh, I want to see him look upon his family. Our dearly beloved brother Jay done went on. Now we done cried and we're going to oh. cry some more. But this episode, we going to take the cry out. I just sat up in this room last night and was ugly it's crying i didn't hold back Angel you didn't. And Josh, they came down to the fume boy they gave me some hugs that i shan't i shan't soon forget angel done graduated to church mother hug when you need it i mm-hmm. said oh that was a that was a beulah may type hug she rocked me she consoled me she wasn't wearing white diamonds but some white diamonds came and got up on her and yeah. did a Assumed that white diamonds came off somebody old, jumped on Angel. Mm-hmm. She came and took me in close. Yes, John I did. Gave me warm embrace. He 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 loved on me. They came down to the repast. Oh, they blessed us. Oh, mm-hmm. they blessed us. They made a food train for us. They sent us food. Mm-hmm. They just loved on us. And I and I thank God. I was saying this in my cry video. All of my friends showed up in their best friendship way. Equally, as we, as they we showed should. up as themselves, and I, 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 my heart grew three bump, my three beats that day, or pumps, whatever happened to the group. <laughs> Listen, so, these kids over here have been praying for y'all. You hear me? They even remember <laughs> y'all's names. They been Amar call upon his name. Uh, you know, Amar don't pray for nobody for real, but <laughs> he did pray one time. Okay, I had to guide him in the words, and he That's did. All right, his side came back. Quiet. So I came back with it last week, praying for y'all. I was like, well, come on then. Keep, keep it going, baby. Keep it going. <laughs> so, yes, uh, we survived Hartford church announcements. Boy, when I tell you my brother's passing plus adding Hartford at the last minute meant there was going to be 17 people up in there. I I promoted like I hadn't had to promote in a long time. You really did. I ain't had to promote every day, once a day for a city in a minute. But then people showed up at Hartford. Burbank sold out. I'm back to doing what I do. Burbank you know sold, out. sold out. I didn't buy my ticket. Ah, I didn't buy my ticket. That's crazy. I know a guy, Angel. I think you'll be okay. 
Okay, because I you was going to go. You, you just come on in with, with Kev. I think you'll be all right. Okay. Columbus, buy your tickets. Ontario, buy your tickets for the rest of the dates. Pull up KevOnStage.com. I'm telling you, Hartford is an aberration. The rest of them cities is not moving as slow as that. Ontario date is, I think, 60% uh, sold out at last check. And also, this agency I'm with, I don't get updates as much as, as quick as I used to. So it might go from almost sold out to sold out very quickly. All right? Also... Wait a minute, wait a minute, wait a minute. Hold on, hold on, hold on, because you you going too fast. How how many weekends y'all y'all going out? How many? Ninety four of of the next fifty two weeks. I am going out. I told my agent no more than three weekends any month. And is that the so case? That have... we're... Okay, thank you, Josh. No, for telling no, me. no, 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 no. Here's the true. thing. Here's the thing with October had Hartford and Columbus and Ontario. That's three. And Ontario is here and Burbank is here. Okay. Pittsburgh has two weekends. December has three. January. Wait a has wow. two. So you no, mean- no, 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 no. November and December only have two weekends because those are holiday months. Let's let's be clear there. Oh. The only I didn't even know those were holiday months. What holidays are in those months? Is there, are they big ones? Are they big holidays? Shut your face. Are they big? (laughs) Shut up. What was your next thing? Sorry, I interrupted you. Well, listen, let me tell you what. If y'all knew what I paid for church, you'd see why I'm about here holding myself out. I I know I understand why you're on the road. I got the account with the opposite direction. The show ain't came out, amen. Uh keep your distance is now free. Free. Hit the link in my bio. I got uh a link to caffeine. Click my link because they judging my link. Don't just download it. Click the link in my bio. Amen. Mm-hmm. Download it. If you can't watch it, at least click the link in my bio. They are judging us by how many people click that link, how many people download caffeine because of that link, and how many people watch the show live. Okay? Mm-hmm. Live is the key. Even if you can only tap it for a minute or two, just try it for a minute or two. If you live in a household with somebody, both of y'all download it and at least turn it on on your phones once. If this don't work, I will tell you with full truth, this is the last keep your distance. And I listen, I don't, my marketing ploy ain't no ploy. If I'm selling tickets, I'll tell you they're selling well. If they ain't selling, they ain't selling. If I tell you that if this show don't work, keep your distance is likely over, I'm telling you the truth. It ain't no marketing ploy. It is the truth. No, that's, also, that, that, that's a decision that's been being flirt with all year. So listen, know that's fact. The problem yeah. with keeping distance that I've said, it's hard to introduce people to new comedians because they tend to not have big platforms. I cannot have CP go every week. Ty Davis can't go every week. Just the people who are funny and bigger numbers wise, they got to use them jokes. They can't do 15, 20 minutes every week. So if y'all want to watch it for free, I, if I, if you don't watch it for free, I don't know what else to tell you. I can't. I don't even. It it's, a, it's a good show, too. It's a great show. I got a whole set on grief. I posted a little bit, but there's more. Matter of fact, Josh, give him a little snippet right now. Okay. And I realized bi- their businesses are not perfect. So I hit them up and be like, with our deepest condolences, this is Johnson and Johnson. Amen, brother. We are so sorry for your lost. And I was like. <laughs> <laughs> For your, for your, for your lost. <laughs> With our deepest condolences, we are so sorry. Loss, that bothers me. So, I sit down, say, hey man, you know how much it's gonna cost? You know, brother, with our deepest condolences, our basic Gemini package. True story. The packages are labeled just like everything else. Our Gemini package gonna cost you 6,500, amen. With our deepest condolences. I said, dang, man, that's a lot. They come with everything. Yes, sir. Casket, flowers, wreath, poster, police escort. Matter of fact, we're going we gonna to throw in police two for one for this. True story. They threw in an extra police officer. With our deepest condolences, we're going to give you one for the front and the back of the motorcade. I said, okay, 6,500 is a lot. You know, okay, we got it. Like, but one more thing, brother. That's just for the stuff on top. If you want to actually bury him, with our deepest condolences, gonna be another six thousand dollars for that. I said that don't come in with the combo meal. You don't get the debt and the ground. No, that's just above ground with the six thousand and it's sixty-five, so about twelve grand. 
with our deepest condolences. <laughs> We're so sorry for your lost. <laughs> Keep your distance is now free. All you got to do is download the Caffeine TV app, follow Comedy on Caffeine, and be notified 8 p.m. Eastern, 5 Pacific, this Friday, October 14th. It's literally free. What more could you ask for? See you this Friday. Let me go and get these Dahmer jokes out the way like everybody else. <laughs> I don't think Dominic's funny. I don't think it's cool that he's famous now because I live when that was out. And that shit was not cool. A white man eating nigga babies? You crazy as <laughs> You crazy <laughs> For real? <laughs> he eating black teenagers? You crazy as hell. I got a mean ass auntie. She, she said shit to me like if he would have ate you, he would have got caught because he would have. <laughs> <laughs> Serial killer blood pressure goes sky high. I done gave Jeffrey Dahmer gout, goddamn. This nigga foot. This nigga foot swole up with me. Hey, he couldn't eat no more niggas after me, goddamn. This nigga. This nigga. That nigga from Atlanta was so delicious. This nigga tastes like lemon pepper and kush. That Atlanta nigga was tasty. We're gonna be chasing the feeling after that, nigga. You'll be stuck on that. That's so awful. Y'all y'all going to hell too. <laughs> my my little one, he don't like asking for stuff because he's afraid of no like kids don't like no. So what he does, he makes suggestions and then I just figure it out and finish it. And then that's how he get what he wants. You know what I mean? It's kinda smart when you think about it, but the shit is ridiculous. Like he'll come in the kitchen and be like, Hey dad, I'll be like, What's up? He'll be like, Hey, I got a question. I'll be like, What? Um I can't I can't remember. Did I have chips today? I can't remember. <laughs> If I had chips, because yesterday, I remember you gave me the chips, but I didn't have the chips today. Or did I? I can't remember. Cause if, but if you're looking for the chips, the, the Doritos are in the cabinet right there. If you just want to take them out and pour them on a plate, that would be great. But I don't know if I had them, but it's, t it's cold, totally up to you. But if you... I'd be like, do you want chips? You'd be like, yeah, yes, I do. I'd be like, why don't you just ask for it? Just ask for the chips. Just ask, but he won't do it. He won't do it. <laughs> and yes, he has a speech impediment. He says all his words up like he does it's cute sometimes but other times it's like all right you got to correct that you know what i'm saying like no because we'll be out we'll be out we'll be walking down the street he'll be like oh dad look at those titties i'll be like first of all that's too loud keep it down keep it down keep it down where, where they at he'll be like right there i'll be like don't point just do this daddy's been doing this a long time just do this i'll figure out where the titties are show me where the titties at man i'm like but i'm not seeing no titties he'll be like the titties right there i'm like don't point just what what are you what are you he'll be like the titty tats i said oh the kitties bro you got to get that right because what you just said I'm thinking something completely different. Just say cats. He refuses to say cats. He just say titties all the time. I'm like, just say cats. He won't do it. You ever tell somebody your birthday, they always want to tell you another mother's birthday that's close to yours? <laughs> and when's your birthday? August 12th. My uncle's on the 13th. I don't give a f what your uncle's birthday is. <laughs> what me do? Get him something? I don't even know this nigga, man. You just gonna volunteer to tell me some <laughs> You ask that question just so you can tell me that. People like to talk. You let them all talk, they'll talk all day. Uh, who's on it? Kev on stage, Tony Baker, Tut Weezy, Jamal Doman, K-Dub, Ronnie Jordan, Jeff Horse. Let me tell you what. P Keon Poli. Keon, Ronnie, K-Dub, Tony, Jeff. Amazing set. Jamal had a good set. Tut Weezy was funnier than I ever seen him before kev on stage was in his bag too i might say i might be a little biased it's one of the good i'm, I'm grateful it happened when we you know got the show with caffeine but it happens to be a great show as well by the grace of god sweet community when y'all shoot that last tuesday the tuesday after the fume uh, this this was funny we were at the we we're at the repast right and uh brendan tony's like see you tuesday i was like what do you mean they're like keep your distance i was like okay Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Cause Kev, man, Kev had to get that off his chest, mm -hmm. and it it worked. So anyway, let's uh let's start. Uh, I missed so many things while we were gone. Uh, we did. There were so many great juicy tidbits. Great juicy yeah. tidbits. I uh, but I didn't miss. We did. There was. Sorry, hit the wrong button. I didn't miss low vibrational meals. Oh. I made sure to put this on. So. If you don't know what a low vibrational meal is, I'm gonna I'm gonna tell you what it is. 
They put this on my plate. I will not let, no, I don't do what they do. I do what I do. I'm a vegetarian. I believe it. But she's I would coach. never eat a plate that looked like this. You couldn't mm. pay me a million dollars to do that to myself. Mm. Oh my God. And it comes through better than that. It's mm. low vibration. And you took it. I would have been like, I'm playing like that. I'll tell you what I want. You'll tell me what I want. So my thought process is if you can put it on my plate, but I don't have to eat it. I got the discipline. I won't even look at it and look that make you look bad. I'm a queen. Queen is plate anyway. Mm. If, I, if we have two plates, we play together. And so who's royalty? They would say this person. Mm. I agree. That's a Good way. <laughs> this well, is serious. <laughs> yeah, because it's a lot of people that just let people give them what they want them to have, mm-hmm. and they accept mm-hmm. it. And Storm is teaching me right now. Yeah, yeah. Oh, Storm is teaching me. Don't accept what they put on your. Mm. Wow. Okay, I'm gonna let this play in the background while I while I say my first piece, Angel. Then I want to hear from you. Mm-hmm. Coach Storm, I don't know nothing about her. This is the first thing I've ever seen of her going viral. Here's my first issue. Y'all plates is from the same cookout. Y'all both got chicken wings. Y'all both got corn. The other lady looks like she has a burger, hot dog, hot link, maybe, and either coleslaw or potato salad. It ain't like you have shrimp and lobster and she has SpaghettiOs. Mm-hmm. Y'all mm-hmm. is getting food. Oh, it just looked like you weren't as hungry as the other person. That's what but I was you like. talk to that woman like she said, I don't want regular food. I want dog food. And the woman, the, the other person, took it like, man, thank you for teaching me, Coach Storm. Because mm-hmm. if, if it was me talking, I looked like we both was at the same cookout and you just had some to hold you over. And I didn't. So I'm, And everybody just... Hmm. Hmm. Mm-hmm. That's mm-hmm. all I want to say first, Angel. But you're a black woman. I want to know if you would have let somebody tell you your food was low vibration. You know, when I eat fruit, it's got to be high vibrational, right? So when I be eating, my fruit got to be cut up in a cup because if not, it's low vibrational, and I am high hungry. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so and you got to do both. You got to you eat your fruit. Mark. And also, this is how a queen sits. <laughs> if you can't see my labia print, how you know I'm a queen? Huh? <laughs> how you going to know? Oh your, plate, your plate look like a hood wrap. My plate look like I'm eating keto. That's the difference I see. But the vibrations of my keto diet let people know I'm royalty. That's the high vibrations. Good vibrations. Oh, my God. No, I don't. People just make up. People just make up. Tom? Have you ever been on a cru- on a Royal Caribbean cruise or any cruise line? Yeah, uh, yeah, yeah. Okay, you know when they go to like Labadee, Haiti, which is not really Haiti, it's just an island they own, and the crews have a barbecue on the little fake island. Uh huh. That's what it looked like they were at, and I'm not meaning disrespect. That I don't had that play at Labadee, Haiti. Listen, I looked up Labadee, Haiti. Wikipedia was like, this is not really Haiti. This is just an island that Royal Caribbean bought. Technically, Haiti is the nearest country, and but really, this ain't real. This is just an island, but you say you've been to Haiti. Yeah. Why you, number one, why you, the people pay to be spoken to that way when they was eating the same vibrational food. Listen, Kevin, this is because the women that follow her are more than likely have low self-esteem. And, I, and, and I'm saying more than likely, so I know I'm generalizing, not everybody, but more than likely have low self-esteem, have been in abusive situations and haven't actually dealt with those things. And they think going to Coach Stormy is the way to go when they really need to go to talk space. Because when it comes to therapy and psychiatry, getting the help you need has never been so simple. All right. When it comes, uh, when you're able to access your provider from the comfort of your device, it means mental health care can be on your schedule, even while you got a low vibrational plate. All right. And elevating 
excuse me, alleviating the wait times to get an appointment or travel time to an office can free up time for the rest of your life so that if you want to still talk to Coach Stormy, you can, but you can let her know you're not going to talk to me this way when I got food to eat. Talkspace is so convenient and accessible. It helps you feel supported around the clock. Y'all know I'm a huge, huge advocate for therapy. Um, my therapist has helped me talk through a lot of uncomfortable situations. I even, uh, when <clears throat> Jason passed, I talked to her during, during that morning process. And there were so many things that she was actually able to get, help me like wrap my brain around that I just cannot advocate enough for therapy. Talkspace lets you send messages to your dedicated therapist in the Talkspace platform, which allows you to update them on the challenges and triumphs you're facing in real time. So you don't have to wait for your next session. With Talkspace, you can set your goals with your therapist and they hold you accountable and make sure you're really progressing. Therapy can help you shift your perspective, find tools to cope in difficult times and be a guiding light. Talkspace is a secure and private, uh, it's secure and private. Using the latest end-to-end -end bank grade encryption technology to store client information and complying with the latest HIPAA regulations. As a listener to this podcast, you'll get $100 off your first month with Talkspace. To, excuse me, to match with a licensed therapist today, go to Talkspace.com. Make sure you use the code, cro, excuse me, make sure you use the code CREW with a K. CREW with, with a K. K. Get $100 off your first month and show your support to the show. That's CREW with a K. CREW with, with a K. K. In Talkspace.com. All right. Now, just y'all, Angel, Josh, hold on to your britches. Because while you was up talking about Talkspace, I said, I wonder how much these events cost. Out of sheer curiosity. Let me tell you what. Juanita Bynum, <laughs> raise your prices. She's got some competition for me. No, 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 no. These are on, yeah, these are on sale. Started off $69.97, Joshy. Put a slash through that. We talking $49.97. Oh, you want to add a third day? You $11.97. These are prices, right? Price. Slash through it. $9,997. 10 bands. Sold out. Five bands. Sold out. Mm. You get to tour and shop around Stormy's most exclusive pieces of clothing and accessories. You get a full day with Stormy Les Brown as you meditate, work out, learn, and party. Enjoy Miami on the waters with brunch included. No low vibrational food there. And mastermind. Throughout your stay, you will have food provided. And so much more. You get five lines of stuff. I just. For 10000 U.S. dollars. We're working and it's too hard. Sold out. If you sold one of these and it's sold out, one of each, you got $15,000 to tell people the food we both eaten, yours is trash. I am doing things wrong. I'm over here <laughs> with this free mentorship with Mama Likes. And I could be over here talking to these chicks cash ass crazy, having them go through my messy closet. For five thousand or ten thousand dollars, Mama likes is over. <laughs> and, and Coach Angel is about to be out here, okay, H at barbecues, telling people they hood rats, making all this uh, money. I can't do it. I'm my, my master class, which grows and is updated, is a hundred and fifty dollars, and I feel bad for that price. I this mean. Woman, for two, we we made fun of Juanita. Juanita, what was Juanita? 1500 1500 And she was going to, that's why I was able to hug you so well, Kevin, because I was mantled. <laughs> you don't know how many times I went back and watched that clip of my good friend Angel going, let me mantle you. <laughs> <laughs> I shit it him out. Let me mantle you. Boy, when I was down in the dumps in Houston, Boy, let me mantle you brought me out many a day. You know, because the mantling is real. Wow, is that okay? okay. What's you, that? Day okay. one is Friday Stormy Closet. Day don't, two, you get to come over here. Day three, don't you look into the eyes. eyes. Right. Eyes <laughs> over the titties. <laughs> huh? Oh my God. Oh my God. Oh, I see. Right. see day one is a two thousand dollar value. Your chance, so you pay two thousand dollars to have a chance to buy her stuff. 
Oh, yeah, oh. to be in her house. I, I, why is it seven thousand dollars to go on a yacht? It should be seven thousand dollars just for the yacht that she's already. So it should only, it shouldn't cost that much for people to be on the yacht. It's a high <laughs> vibrational yacht, Angel. Clearly, and we don't got understand. Les Brown. He's that dude who you working out. Look at this house. That's an Airbnb. Imagine yeah. a weekend getaway where you're surrounded with positivity, inspiration, no low vibrational food. Wait, we've been doing this for free? I Gosh. guess. We're doing it Obviously, wrong. Obviously, we don't know a doggone thing. Listen, man, these stories always remind me people will pay for whatever they perceive to be valuable. Yeah. And they will pay more than you think <laughs> they will pay. I don't I'm, know. And listen, Coach Stormy, listen, don't get upset with me. I <laughs> admire your ability. Listen, I you can't imagine ever charging $15,000 for anything. She's about to make me want to get coached by her to be like, now what is you doing? Actually, I don't. <laughs> I'm going to be like, how much I got to pay? For real, tell me what you're doing. That, that's Man. impressive. She's, she's charging a Kia Soul. I'm like, let me go and get this mommy makeover and a BBL and a lace front and start talking to people crazy because that's what is necessary, I think. Yes, she said that plays for a hood rat as she sucked on her fingers. That's a hood rat play. <laughs> you know, I would never. Get, I would never. I was never letting nobody give me. They're going to pay me a million dollars. They're going to play like that. You could not play me. Because I'm a queen. I'm loyalty. You will never. That food was made by the same vibrations. And she's trying to no! differentiate vibrational food and not. <laughs> Woo! I, I can't even. Yeah, they well, both eat off of paper plates. Ain't nobody eating off of China. Man, I'm doing it wrong. I'm doing it wrong. You are, Ooh. Angel. Selling mama likes boxes. Boxes. Well, I got to let it go. You got the nerve to be giving away free mentorship. This is stupid. This Alicia is why she get man. Anymore. She's the highest paid network marketer in health and wellness, largest meditation community of colored women. Coach forty two families into becoming seven figure earners. That's a million. Words you will often hear of spending time in the presence of Stormy Wellington, visionary of go. Girl, hold my hand. Oh, she's incorporated. Yeah, come on, man. Yes, I wonder what MLM is, is, is she in. What MLM is she in? Uh, looks like this health and wellness superfood. Uh, I don't my fruit? Oh, she has a she has planners downstairs. Girl, hold my hand. I know. I need. I need whatever she's putting out. People hate you can create. People hate you can create. She a blood? Wait, 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 but wait, you spell with why. You spell with her why. So she spelled Mike, actually. <laughs> Hey, I just I, saw a comment. I try to find it. Somebody said, but they both eating off paper plates. <laughs> oh, man. Well, is that Amar? Yes. Hey, man. You say say hi. They can hear you. Say hi. Hi. Oh. Hi, buddy. I oh. know you. You can say hi for a second. Look at this hey, here. Amar. Don't eat that low vibrational fruit, Amar. I wouldn't let nobody give that to me. That's low vibrational fruit. It's pre-cut. It's, it's real good. Tell Say love you. High mm -hmm. vibrational fruit. Missy, he just told you he love you. Say love you. Mm -hmm. He didn't hear that. Say it louder. Say, mm -hmm. say love you. Love you too, baby. Come spend the night. <laughs> say bye-bye. Bye-bye. All right. God bless you, Amar. You sweet little boy. All right, moving on. <clears throat> uh, okay. We're gonna we're gonna we're gonna talk a little bit about uh, this person. She's she's a friend of the pod. She just hasn't been on yet. Brittany Renner has a new commercial out. And friend of the pod. Yeah. Ooh, the pod. Here we go. Let's take a look at this. 
Oh, stop it. The side chicks I've seen that look better than me are these right here. Introducing three new, thicker, juicier side chicks. Angel, I went first on low vibrational food. I'll let you I'll let you take the first swing at this. Well, you know, you know what they say. If you say it about yourself first, can't nobody use it against you. And she was just like, she's embracing it. It's just like Superhead. You know, Corinne, she mm -hmm. was like, you know what, y'all, I know y'all going to talk about the fact that I be sucking on them things. So, you know what, let me go ahead and monopolize off of it. So, you know, this chick is like, absolutely. Am I out here being uh, a bit of trash? You know what I'm saying? Not to, well, I was about to say not to judge her, but that was literally a judgmental statement. But, you know, she's got a whole national commercial. Hopefully they paid her well, you know, but I'm doing things wrong is what, I, th what this all comes back around to. If Stormy, Coach Stormy didn't teach me, Brittany Renner did, because I'm out here being a faithful woman to one man that I'm married to. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> and I ain't got no national commercial on TV right now. I got an audition for him. You she got an audition. <laughs> She did her audition already. She did. Right. I'm doing it wrong. If you didn't okay. know, Two Chains, and I didn't know this before this story broke. Two Chains is the head of marketing at Crystal. I head believe. of marketing. He's he's actually he's a pretty of, good. Yeah, he's actually a pretty good businessman. He's the head of creative marketing, and he has a pulse on the culture. It was his idea. It seems like to do this. Let me tell you what the best thing you can do to be marketed well. And Brittany Renner does it. And Angel just said it. I just want to emphasize it. Knowing who you are, best thing. Being comfortable with who you are is the second best thing. She turned the Internet's angst for her into a depositable check for herself. Whether, yo, what's better than finding quality candidates, finding them instantly for a powerful hiring, hiring partner, you need Indeed. Indeed is a hiring platform where you can attract, interview and hire all in one place. Don't spend hours on multiple job sites looking for candidates with the right skills when you can do it all with Indeed. Find top talent fast with Indeed suite of powerful hiring tools like Indeed Instant Match assessments and virtual interviews. Hate waiting? Indeed's U.S. data shows over 80% of Indeed employers find quality candidates whose resume on Indeed matches their job description the moment they sponsor a job. Y'all know I used Indeed when I was looking for my assistant. I found so many quality quality candidates. I know they sent me at least 40 people that matched all the qualifications that I had put in there. And um, I'm talking about location. I was able to, you know, base it off of that, uh, social media skills, as well as other like other digital skills that I needed. And with Instamatch, it was so super simple. Candidates you invite to apply through Instamatch are three times more likely to apply to your job than candidates who only see it in a search, according to US Indeed data. With Instamatch, as soon as you sponsor a post, you get a short list of quality candidates whose resume on Indeed match your job description, and you can invite them to apply right away. Indeed does the hard work for you, sponsor a job, and boom, Instamatch shows you you, you you candidates whose resume on Indeed fit your job description immediately after you post. With Instamatch, you can start hiring fast. Join over 3 million businesses worldwide using Indeed to hire great talent talent fast. Indeed knows that when you're doing everything you're, for your company, you can't afford to overspend on hiring. Visit Indeed.com slash HTT to start, to start hiring today. Just go to Indeed.com slash HTT. HTT. Indeed.com slash HTT. HTT. <laughs> Terms and conditions apply. Cost per application pricing not available for everyone. Need to hire? You need Indeed. And you know we are not done all right so as we go into the holiday season black friday season like josh just dropped some amazing mugs uh i got two already we're about to put out some merch some shirts 
we are trying to set ourselves up now so that we can have a very successful, okay, successful Black Friday season because we want to be ready for the right moment. So the best time to prepare for growth is before the opportunity arrives, especially for online businesses. ShipStation sets you up for growth by directly integrating with every shopping cart and storefront. So your product... Your products are easier to find, easier to manage, and easier to get into the hands of happy customers. Don't wait until you're drowning in orders to find the right shipping solution. Upgrade to ShipStation today. I'm telling you, it can get so stressful around uh, fulfillment time. When we drop the the bonnets and the robes again, which we're about to drop another set of robes and bonnets, but a completely different style, I know how crazy it can get trying to get all of that together. Well, with ShipStation, it brought all of our platforms together. I'm talking about all of Marcus's beard butter, my robes, everything, making it very easy to have it all in one interface. Whether you're starting a small small or scaling up, ShipStation makes ship happen. No, no more limiting your business to one store. ShipStation integrates with every platform, including Amazon, Etsy, eBay, Spotify, Shopify, and et cetera. Making it easy to manage all your shipping from one simple dashboard. Maximize your sales with minimum effort. Get the same discounted shipping rates as Fortune 500 companies, whether you're sending a stack or a truck full. Join over 130,000 companies who've grown their e-commerce business with ShipStation. 98% of companies that use ShipStation for one year become customers for life. Um, there are so many great, great companies that you should definitely check out. The use ShipStation, a uh, Wolfgang Puck Home is a really good business, as well as Latched Mama in Passion Planner. Ship more and grow more with ShipStation. Go to ShipStation.com today and sign up with promo code Crew with a K. Crew with a K. For a free 60-day trial, start today and get set up before the biggest shipping season of the year. That's two months free. Visit ShipStation.com, click on the microphone at the top, and type in code CREW with a K. CREW, Crew with a K. Quick note, quick note on the mugs, though, guys. Uh, I dropped them on my Patreon first, but the next time we shoot here, I'm going to give the stage crew their early access as well before it goes public, public. I just want to – I don't want you guys – to not have an opportunity is what I'm saying. I, uh, I'm a part of Josh's Patreon. That's Thank how you, I got Very drugs. much. Shit. Other quick side note. Let's not forget that 2 chains sold like $2 million in Christmas hoodies or sweaters in like 2015. He did. He's an astout marketer. S astute also. Yeah, I was. I said it, and I was like, "It's you not right." I would just double down. Oh, no. I thought a stout works. I mean, it's compact, and it's just in them to just saturate the market that's right thank you thank you angel mm -hmm. listen i i, I want to be clear i am not mad at this at all i think this is genius from two chains from britney and from uh was it crystals or rallies crystals? crystals from crystals i mean i don't live where crystals is present but i'm like that's a marketing piece of marketing material that made it nationwide that was viral on twitter where crystals didn't even pay that thing had two three million views on it i believe at the Does time crystals is crystals like guapped up like that they got money like that i don't know i don't know i mean i feel like britney renner's not doing that for less than 500k i don't think that's true oh really i think she would do it for a lot less <laughs> really <laughs> What? Yeah, Let me tell you what. Let me yeah, tell you what I meant. That shoot was 150k by itself. No that talent included. True. Also, that could not be true. Oh. Let me tell you what, Josh. Let me tell you what I've learned about this business. There's a lot of people acting like they're getting paid a lot of money, and most of them are not getting paid near as near as much as we think they are. A lot of times for the appearance of what it looks like you're getting paid, people will take something because that that shoot wasn't cheap. I mean, you can tell by the lighting setup and all the crystal clarity. It, it could have been 150. Okay. I doubt it was 650, including her talent fee. I'm not saying she doesn't deserve money. I'm just saying she probably could have did that for 25K or 50K or 75. Half a million that's real flow type money. I highly doubt Crystals spent that to pay Brittany Renner. I don't know. I could be wrong. I'm but curious. I highly doubt. If she, she has a, it, 
if she has a rollout of a lot more commercials, then that's when. Like if this is if it's like, yo, Brittany, we about to have a rollout of like five commercials, five different commercials in this year, all around the side chick. I think you could start to crank up the price, but it's not starting there. That's uh that's spokesperson. That's first time spokesperson type of money. And even then, that's it's still flow. gonna be that high. Oh no, flow way past that. Early, early flow, not now. Yeah, that's early. That's like year two, three of flow. Yeah, flow don't got to do nothing else but do a progressive commercial once every two or three months, and and then count the, her, the dollar signs going up. Flow at home eating low vibrational plates. <laughs> with a leg gapped open, okay, <laughs> Monday through Friday. Is Crystal's low vi vo low vibrational food? If they have a side chick sandwich, so absolutely not. <laughs> we decided, what, do we even know what low vi vibrational food? What does that even mean? Coleslaw and <laughs> and potato salad are low vibrational foods, apparently. <laughs> Barbecue chicken is not, just for the record. Barbecue chicken is the highest. Uh, of, no, the highest oh, is shrimp. You saw them shrimp. That's what made it queen-like. To have you know, shrimp. I, I didn't say this out loud. You know they say your taste buds change as you age? Mm -hmm. I used to love scallops. I don't like scallops no more. I can't the texture. The last three scallops I ate, that texture was just I couldn't do it. And lately, I ain't been feeling shrimp like that. I don't know what it is. But you would still fix your mouth around some pumpkin pie, huh? Oh Lord. The pumpkin oh, pie is high vibrational dessert, first of all. I, first, I was about to send you a low vibrational milkshake last night. You and Melissa, y'all about to get a ring at y'all's doorbell in the middle of y'all's video. You should have. I really was, but I was like, they're having a, a moment. Let me not interrupt it by ordering them some milkshake. Last night was big trash. Oh, big. Yeah, I was. I was, about to, I was about to be like, you hit some milkshakes to drown you. You should Sorry, have. Man. <laughs> let's, Sorry, keep man. The, uh, let's keep the low vibrational food topic going. Let that baby talk, Angel. Yeah, loud. <sighs> oh boy. Company launches vagina flavor chips so, so millennials can get laid more. Do you see the flavor here? And I'm not going to keep this up long. Uh, the chips supposed to taste like coochie. At what pH though? You know, because sometimes there's like the variation depending on what was eaten that day. I think there's were a lot you, of outliers that they're not accounting for. Were you on this panel to come up with the flavor, Josh? No, but I kind of wish I would have for the sake of a variety pack. You know, like Frito Lay has theirs with the Fritos, with the Cool Ranch, with the nacho cheese. Josh is like, I've done my research. I'm just, I, I'm just really down. I looked up this website. These are for real on sale right now. Did you, did you order some? I think we should no. taste them as a unit. I like to get mine I fresh from know. the source. You know how they have like, they bottle water at the source. And the further it gets away from that, the less crisp it is. It's like, yeah, it's like telephone, you know? It's just like telephone. I, I like to go. I luckily, I you know, for the last twenty years, I I didn't I didn't had direct access, so I, I just go, it's fresher that way. It's more. I don't want no coochie chips now. When they do some dick cookies, I'll give it a whirl with y'all. They're but pushing I'm me. Not, I'm not eating no. I don't want to eat it from the source. I don't. I don't want you know. Listen, let me tell you. I don't know why a man would want some coochie chips because I feel as though. The thing that makes that an acceptable thing to do is because of the person attached. Yes, Angel. The Amen. thing. And as you saw on the picture, they got some tall six foot five white lady with a butt cheeks open on top of some chips. That I wouldn't think would be the thing that would get it going. Like, I actually don't want to try dick cookies. I actually, I would. But I don't really want to. Because that's not what makes that exciting for me. Amar, I am talking about dick cookies. What? Okay, go downstairs and get some. There's some fruit. Go downstairs. Daddy's got it. I didn't even think about 
is it one coochie that they that they you know put up to the chip to apply? Is it a variety it, of packs? It is a one wahite coochie, is what I'm it looks out. like. No, they had a bunch of people who uh did market research. They sent Alleg- them out alleged allegedly. Yeah, they had they had sent them out and they uh all came back describing the taste and they, they figured brought, how to they brought back a, a swab each as well. <laughs> they took COVID tests and just mm. put it in the little beaker and didn't shake it. They just held it. Mm-mm, yeah, flame it high, coochie shit. This is she got uh, a yeast infection. I don't think you need. I don't think you need a spicy. No, no. I was just about to say this. Yeast infection will be sour cream, coochie chips. <laughs> oh God. Oh, hey. <laughs> oh God. <laughs> that that sour cream and onion. Oh yeah, it is. Oh bless. Barbecue off. is that monthly chip, hey, man. <laughs> <laughs> There you go. There that's you go. Miss Vicky, that's that Miss Vicky's jalapeno. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Listen, I don't, I don't want it. There's been so many coochie products. Erica Badu sold coochie something. Was it, it was incense? incense? It was the incense. incense. Yeah, I got some at the crib. Do you really? No, absolutely not. Oh, that I thought because your boy worked with her. That wouldn't fly. Your your girl wouldn't like that. I don't think so. I that's not. A, I'm not gonna try it. Is that Erica Badu's coochie I smell in the <laughs> instance? I feel like that's kind of fetishy, man. I don't know. Big fetish. That's I, I don't like it. I remember they were selling. I feel like Gwyneth Paltrow. Somebody said this. Gwyneth Paltrow was selling vagina candles. Yes. On Orange is the New Black, which I believe this actually was a real business. Women was selling uh, used panties with. Secretions included. Gwyneth Paltrow? Yeah. Gwyneth Paltrow. What, is, what, is what, is that, what is that set off of hers? She I don't know. Coochie. No. I don't I feel like it's too it's oversaturated in the market. It's not a good candle smell. It's not. I, Coochie is having a wild PR season. No. Man. Oh, needs to get it it needs the publicist to kind of bring it reel it back in reel it back in you can't just have a regular cooch no more it's gotta you gotta do all these things with it and i just eh, enough do peens enough. have peens have a taste do they have taste it tastes like skin so like is it like if you lick the arm and lick the peen is it the same i mean unless you, you've been uh working out then there is the body fall is something else, but see what you're not you're you're comparing the skin of a penis, which is not what you should be comparing. It is the liquid that flows from the secretion. Flows. Amen. The that's the, that has a different taste. The honey and milk. Yes, <laughs> that's a different. Taking two weeks off. This is what I we this we is need to we're, this out we're throughout not multiple episodes. <laughs> Listen, it, I gotta, it, I gotta flag this one for YouTube ads now. I'm just saying that's not something that I would be willing to deal with if it wasn't attached to the person it's attached to. I'm not going to the store asking for some jizz in a cup. That's just <laughs> <laughs> salt and vagisil chips. I love it. Y'all are going, oh, oh no, this can't go on Kirk Frank. I don't think they're gonna renew my contract down to Kirk Frank's no. praise. I, you know, I can't say for certain, but I feel like this might be a one and done. Uh, be very grateful, but I. This is this isn't even the bonus. Speaking of which, I need to make sure I ask you a question about your previous pastor who uh, I met at the repast. It, he was. We were talking about Kirk Franklin praise, but I need to ask you a question. Oh. Okay, put it, put in the private my chat. air time. When is my air time? Oh, they, they did us like a like yep. yep. When are we airing? Radiant J. <laughs> they put us they put us at 2 a.m. We're Kurt Franklin after dark. <laughs> when they were recruiting us, I told I said they knew what we was doing. Okay. I'm like, uh-huh. 
Listen, they knew what I was doing. I didn't I didn't ask to come down to Kurt Franklin. All right. They let me on. All right. Moving on. This is crazy. This was from right away. Uh, right. Let's see how right this minute. No, this is right. Uh, the week we took off. There is a new. <laughs> this doesn't even. This sounds fake. When you when you say it, but this is true. There is a new documentary coming to Pe- Peacock that will expose the dark side of the kids' show Barney, including death threats, drug rumors, and intense hatred. Titled "I Love You, You Hate Me." What was going down over to Barney's children's program? The same thing that be going on at all these programs. It's adults acting terrible. Adults be acting like they ain't got no sense. But a lot of it sounded like it was stuff coming in from the outside, coming in from like viewers and stuff. But again, people are crazy out here. People ain't got no sense is what I'm learning. Oh, no. People ain't got no sense, Angel. That's... Listen. (laughs) That's the truth. I I just you would think something like Barney. It's a dinosaur. He's singing to multicultural kids. He's you know it. He's a dinosaur, so there definitely shouldn't be no problem with. Oh, I don't want a black person or a Latino person teaching my kids how to care. It's a purple dinosaur. People will still find a way to Man. pervert it, make it crazy, all of it. What was going? What were they doing? <laughs> Hi, kids. I'm going to murder you. What, Barney? He's I've making them a... clean up too much. Man, they were sick and tired of picking up everything. <laughs> oh, listen, I'm sure. I hate cleaning up, too. That's why I get Hello Fresh because I can get farm fresh pre-portioned ingredients and seasonal recipes delivered right to my door. So that keeps me from having to throw away a lot of stuff. I don't have to throw away old food because HelloFresh sends me the exact amount, okay? I'm not having to throw away a bunch of grocery bags because HelloFresh puts the whole meal in one bag. What you say? Skip trips to the grocery store and count on HelloFresh to make Home cooking, easy, fun, and affordable. That's why it's America's number one meal kit. Subscribe to HelloFresh and check, uh, check save money off your fall to-do list. I've been out here cooking for these kids. I made this um, zucchini, like, pizza thing. It was on, like, a flatbread with this, like, uh, uh, green onion, um what was it, a uh, cream cheese type of thing with some Parmesan and some mozzarella and I sauteed the zucchini, put it on top. That thing was fire. <laughs> um, we cook the meals all the time. HelloFresh works with your ever-changing schedule. Plans are flexible and you can choose your meals for each week, update your preferences or change your delivery date in uh, all in the HelloFresh app. And they have things for, like, regardless of how you eat, whether you want something that's like 20 minutes, that's like the from there quick and easy, or if you're a person that needs a pescatarian plan like myself, you can get it. We love it, and we want you to try it. I actually just cooked some uh, Green Chef recently that was delicious, and what you know is that Green Chef and every plate are now owned by HelloFresh, and with a wide array of meal plans to choose from, there's something for everyone, and I love switching between the brands, and now our listeners can enjoy both brands at a discount on us. Go to HelloFresh.com slash SK65. SK65! Code SK65 for 65% off plus free shipping. Go to HelloFresh.com slash SK65. 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 Code SK65 for 65% off and free shipping. It's HelloFresh, America's number one meal kit. Listen, apparently part of this is that like people just started to hate Barney. I remember that uh, there was a, like a lot of Barney backlash. Um <laughs> Apparently, part of this Barney, part of Barney led to 4chan, which is, I don't even know what 4chan is. I don't I either. I was waiting for you to tell me. Somebody in the stage crew, can you explain what 4chan is? Because I, I, I think I understand that. I feel like it's like Discord slash Reddit slash. You know what Fortune 500 is. Hey, oh. 
Josh I'll just wait for a comment to tell us what it is because stay smart. It's Reddit, it's Reddit but scary. scary. 5chan, Kev. 5chan? Dark Web Discord. 4chan is a mass message board for professional trolls. Oh, no. Reddit's evil cousin. Oh. For professional trolls. Reddit's Jesus. Okay, so I was kind of on it. It's a message board place where people go, <laughs> go crazy. <laughs> Sounds awful. Oh, my God. Terrible. People are, people are crazy. People are crazy. People are crazy. Hold on one second. When it comes to the kids, they be. And Barney used to bop. Barney used to what? Barney used to bop. Yes, he did. I love you. Come, come on, sing. You love me. Yada no bosh. Hey. Come on, choir, say family. family. Oh. With a great big hug and a kiss from me to you. Hallelujah. Come on, say, won't you? Hey! Won't you say, won't you, say you love me too? Amen. How many of you know that Jesus first loved us? Mm. Amen. He loved us so much that he got up on that We're happy. For our sins. That's great. Praise team just right there. Good. Now, 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 we are happy. Because in a kiss from me to you. Father, the Son, and the Holy Ghost, for God's Jesus is just saying, I already died for you. Oh, just say you love me too. <laughs> won't you just say, won't you come? All of us were saying, just already said, I love you. Your words say you love me, but do your actions love me? The Bible says, my sheep they come running to me. And a kiss from me to you. Won't you say, won't you say, yeah, yeah, they all sound good, praise team. Won't you say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Won't you say, you love, love, hey. love, 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 me. <laughs> to Ooh, hallelujah. Tell them that you love them. Tell them that you love them. Yeah, yeah. Tell them. What's the other, uh, what's the Lamb Chops? What was their song? Yeah. Lamb Chops, play along where kids come to play along and fun things are all we ever do, 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 do. Well, this Lamb Chops play. They used, to, they used to go off. I don't remember Lamb Chops. I don't know. Lamb Chops, play along. This is the song that never is. Oh, what, no. the, what land were they talking about, though? Some people you know started land land singing land. and not knowing what it was, and they'll continue singing it forever just because this is the song that doesn't. They were talking about the lamb. Of yeah, God. yeah. That's true. Yeah, hey. yeah, 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 yeah. I wish I knew the lyrics, huh? Yeah. Because when I give you a word, but I don't know the lyrics to Lamb Shop. What did they say in the song? I don't know. I just know the song that uh, <laughs> they never chopped my lamb up on that goddamn on cross is what they did. Yeah, they chopped him for our sins. Hmm. Yeah. Mm hmm. Mm -hmm. So yeah. the next time you're eating some savory lamb chops, a high vibrational lamb chops, know that the greatest lamb of all is at yeah. the highest vibration. Hmm. 
in heaven sitting on the right side of the Father. Of the Father. Hmm. Yes. Yes. Please come. Give your life to him now. <laughs> Wait a minute, Kevin. I have to say that daggone. What's her name? Uh, Prophet of Red Jacket. What's that baby's name? Anna Douglas. Anna Douglas. When she broke that goddamn on fork. Angel. That girl is talented. Hold on. Let me play the video for y'all if y'all ain't seen it. When is Churchy coming out? It is October 30th. Oh, is this the announcement? Yes. October 30th. Ooh, it's going to be a spooky one. <laughs> How do you take him out? How do you take him out? All right. Just put him in timeout for a little bit. I want him to why, why you put my friend Josh in timeout? Are you ready to behave, Josh? What do you mean? It's Halloween, man. What do you do? What do you want from me? I said, where's this my friend is, go? This is the harvest night. I've this said is worse. Night. Oh, it's Hallelujah Fun Night. What you talking about? <laughs> this it's trunk or treat night, man. What do you wow. really expect? This is Anna Douglas in her in her bed. Yeah. <laughs> Give him the globe. Yes, yes, of course. Oh, no, 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 no. I said I give him glory. You're, you're not just going to sit there. You're going to get give him the glory. Give him the glory. All right, then. All right, you call me in here. You, you want me to pray, pray for you, don't you? Don't you? Huh? You, you want me to? You no, need to be no. the no. living and set free, no, huh? No, no, I don't know. Come no, 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 no. Okay. No, that's, that's, that's actually, actually why, why I brought, I brought you, you in. in. Oh, okay, okay. Uh, she has a mic. A couple of the members have been that, <laughs> that when you pray, pray for them, them you're, you're too heavy-handed. Too heavy-handed? That's where the deliverance take place. What are you talking about? Um, You pawned a baby's head and had their feet dangling. You look like Jordan on the baseline. Um, that was just the christening. That's all that was. That was almost a lawsuit. Mute. People need to be delivered and set free. I don't have time to play patty cake with the devil. Just because you want to take the devil out to lunch and say, excuse me, devil, do you mind leaving the people of God? No! I came to crush the devil's head. Well, could you crush the devil's head and leave the people's head intact? You know, the Bible says we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but I came to crush the devil's head. And if they happen to be in the way of that, so be it. All right. I just want to do a little exercise, okay? How about you just try and, and pray for this fork gently? Oh, okay. Give it here. Blessed be the name. Oh, blessed be the... Oh, there's a spirit on here that come out from a... I rebuke every spirit, every lying spirit, every deceitful spirit. I rebuke it right now. You have no room. Do you see the freedom in this book right now? Do you see how free it is? Okay. Okay. All right. Thank you. Thank you so much. Oh, you, no problem. God bless you. Thank you so much. Oh, I, God I bless you. you. Okay. You got to rebuke it right now. Come out from amongst him. Get out of, let him go. I rebuke it right now. He don't know what he's saying. Yeah. He don't know. Don't let him be led by the devil anymore. Let him go. Freedom right now. Freedom Hey, so wait a minute. You didn't change people's names in the actual script. Huh? Did you change people's names in the script? To change our names? Yeah. Did you leave, like, from your experiences, did you leave a lot of, like, the names of the people that you experienced inside the script? Or did you, like, change names and stuff? Like, create characters for them? Yeah, like I know, like for some of the for some of the characters in the actual show, they are based off of real people in your real life. For those, oh yeah, I changed their people. name. Okay, to protect the innocent. And this this is not based off my real life. This is purely coincidental. Right? No, 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 no. I know it's not based <laughs> off of your real life. No, I know that. I know that. I know it. But yeah, know. everybody everybody's name has changed. That's if you if, any any semblance to a, a character living or dead is purely coincidental. Right. Purely. Before we go, somebody asked me to play this video 
This is one of the fa- my favorite things in the world. And I'm just going to play it for y'all. We were going to get to this podcast topic, but we'll just start the bonus episode off with it. And we'll tell you when that's about to be. But this, this, these two people, Buster and TJ, uh, the real black cousins, I think they're called, they have given me so much joy. Your boy Buster, my very first podcast. Nobody's ever done a podcast ever before. It's me here, my best friend. This is the Buster Experience. I'm here with a special guest. I already said my best friend, DJ. What up? And we got another special guest, little daddy. Hello. You know, it's a bunch of craziness going on right now. How is this affected what y'all got going on, like with your everyday life? You know what I'm saying? Because me, I can't make pancakes like I used to. Mm -hmm. I've been doing these uh, new drugs, actually. Now um, you've been you've experimented with psychedelics in the past. For right? sure, uh, I've been doing these new drugs called vegetables. Mm. Uh, it's been a real trippy experience, man. Uh, I thought I had like depression, ADHD, short attention span. Come to find out, I was just malnourished. Uh, TJ, yes. You remember that one time? Yes. Y'all remember that, that one? That place. Yeah. Yeah, so, yeah, 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 yeah. It yeah. definitely was a place. Yeah. It wasn't a people or a thing for sure. It wasn't. It wasn't. It wasn't a person. And the craziest thing about this place, it had doors. You could walk in and out of it. Hey, hold on, hold on. Places right. with doors. <laughs> hold on. Let me. Hold on. Let me. Let me say. Whoa, 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 whoa. Let me say something. What's, what's up with doors? It's crazy that you say that because I'm always like. Turning knobs. What? You don't get out of here. So you, <laughs> hey, can you relax? Can you... Jamie, can you look up a door real look quick? Look up a door. Look up a door. My second thing about places that I love is windows. I love a breeze. I love I a lo- good window. Hey. To the window, to the wall, as one great man once said. Not hey. a wall fan. Not, Not a, a wall. Fan. Walls are terrible. A wall killed my father, bro. I ain't going. I'm sorry, man. Yeah, Jamie, wall. can you look up a wall, a wall that killed yeah. his father? It's crazy because as crazy. a man, like women should worship me. You feel me? Wow. wow. So, um, like, man eats steak, pork, chitlin. Woman eats salad. That's just what it is. I want to watch football game, eat food. With women, <laughs> they they supposed to be they supposed to be loving us. You feel what I'm saying? Man, are you married by chance? Nah, man, I ain't never had a girlfriend. Okay, but what I'm saying is the reason why I haven't had one is because it's women's not... be tripping. Yeah, I also think. Uh... We've come to a stopping point. I don't even look women in eyes. Because I feel like if I look at one, it's going to turn me to stone. What just Luda, happened? Luda, I think uh, I think we're about to end I up. ain't no uh, misogynist. I ain't never gave out a massage in my entire life. We're going to end the podcast here. Uh, thank you so much, little daddy. TJ, my best friend. Thank you so much. Real men's fixed car. I, can't, I, I don't, can't I don't fix, not fix car. car. You can't fix no car. I, don't have a car. I am a car. <laughs> I'm going to drive off right now. <laughs> Wee! Uh, going to an ad. Um... When I tell you I have watched that video so many times, I don't know why I was Jamie. Can you look up a door real quick? And that person, <laughs> I don't like walls, man. A wall killed my father. Jimmy, can you look up a wall that killed his daddy? <laughs> Men eat. Pork, steak, chitlin, women eat salad. That just is what it is. <laughs> I want to watch football games, eat food. food. I just been going around my house saying that. Bless Real men fix cars. You can't <laughs> fix no car. I am a car. <laughs> what? It's the insanity. It is so. I would watch a thirty minute program from whoever. The minds behind that. I follow them all on Twitter. The real, I think it's the real black cousins on uh, Instagram. It's hilarious. <sighs> it's hilarious. It's very funny. Shout out to those guys. All right. Uh ba 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 ba. Um enough. This is a good time. It's good to be back with, with Josh and Angel. I'm happy to be here. You guys are great friends. Stage crew, you were missed. Thank y'all for telling me to take my time. I actually did. I didn't go on Patreon and make no video. So proud of you. For two whole weeks. Uh, oh, my guys. We'll talk about that. We'll talk about that. Kevin, 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 Kevin. Kevin. Yeah. I want to just say publicly that I was just 
so uh what is the word the word wasn't proud but i'll use it for now of the amazing job you all did uh in sending your brother off oh. i want to say that publicly you all did a beautiful job and if it was representing the love you all had for him i it then I'm telling you made it very much so known how important he was to you. And I also want to thank you for allowing us to be with you all in the way that you allowed us to be with you all and to be in that moment with you all, because I do think mourning is a very private and sacred thing. So I just want to say thank you for allowing us to be you all's friends in the way that felt comfortable in that moment. And I want to say this to both of you. I'm, trying to feel my feelings, so just let me say. Let me mentor you! <laughs> you gonna say something stupid! I want to mentor you! <laughs> I'm not going there today, Angel. I wasn't trying to make you cry. I just oh, wanted to make you. sure I said it. You don't have to be trying. It was happening. The back of my <laughs> eyes started warming up, and I said, no, 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 no. I will no. say, though, man, that feels ah, shut lit. up. It was let lit. me say the words. It was lit. Let I'm going to leave it at that. I'm going to save the sentiments off for off camera, but that funeral was lit. It was a good time. It was a banger. Banger, banger, banger. banger. They face off. Come on. Come it was on. Great. I, I, listen, we, boy, we had a time. We laughed. We cried. Lexi sang. Mm -hmm. My mom Your mother had a hot five, a hot five set. My five. mom got some jokes off. I said, "Okay, Sheila, get you some jokes off." Lexi saying, "There go Kev." He, I cried. We prayed. We preached. It was great, as great as a funeral could be. My cousin had looked like a celebrity. Yes, she did. Rebecca looked great. She looked great. And your grandmother did great. Your grandmother told me she loved me like I was one of her own. I oh, they like, listen, my family. She had she had a remembered Angel's name. You know who I was. She said, Now, what is your name? <laughs> she never they was listening to you she at the house, lost. Angel. They what? They was looking for you at the house. Uh Tony and Tahir came over to the house. I I just did I I, I wanted to I didn't know what we were good to come over for. That's why I bought a, a quick flight in, quick flight out. No, yeah. I, I, I'll remember that forever, Josh. Don't worry. That's fine. You, you Let me back for you. <laughs> no. no, we were there, but yeah, no, I didn't want to be in the way. Uh we I would have yeah. definitely went over, but I was just like, there's a lot of people I don't want to add myself to the equation if Same. it is it if it's in the way, you know. We also we also weren't invited, so Whatever, Joshua. We'll go out on a little bit of uh, a little bit of Lexi, cause she's saying, "Boy, I almost forgot she's saying heaven down." You better sing, Lexi. I don't know what you come to do. Let me hear you say, "Come on." Don't know what you come to do.
from Galilee. That's my brother, Tam. And I love him. He's my brother and I love him like myself. I can't hold it. Yeah, that was. <clears throat> Lexi took a long time. Amen. 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 Song two song. We said one. She sung two. Snuck that second one in there. Said no music, man. You had, you had one selection. It's how church folk do. I got my mind. She snuck her stuff in. It's all right. Yeah, yeah. All right. <laughs> have some reflections from some of Jay's. Andrew, you all right, daughter? Yes, amen. You all right? I was, I was next to Angel when that song was happening. She was doing everything in her power to keep herself from twerking in front of everybody. <laughs> oh, listen, I was going to be twerking and crying. Watch me. <laughs> ooh, ooh, watch me. Especially because me, uh, me and McKinley were sitting together and she was doing whatever I was doing. So she would have been twerking with me. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I'd be like, yeah. back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back it up. Back, back, back in this early in life, Angel. 
Oh, listen, she already know how to pack pack. I saw her TikTok. I said, oh, this girl got moved. She be on TikTok, man. Do. It's private. Don't y'all even go searching for it. You can only, <laughs> it's only available if Mel follows you. Mm -hmm. uh, but no, man, my friends really pulled up on me. I, I learned a lot about friendship during this time. And I, I am grateful the people that I call friends were friendly. Amen. It was, it made it easier. It ain't easy, but it's easier. And I appreciate y'all stage crew. Y'all held us down. Y'all gave, even though y'all didn't have to. And you know, we made, we sent that on to the family and I just appreciate y'all. All right. We love y'all. We'll see y'all soon. God bless you. God keep you. We'll see you at the conference. There's another thing for There's another one. Here's another thing for you. Here's another one. Here's another thing for you. Here's another thing for you. With my boy Kevin Stay. And that chick angel.